Welcome to our tech troubleshooting video. Today, we're addressing a frustrating issue that many developers encounter when working with the YouTube API. Our viewer is trying to retrieve a list of videos uploaded to their channel, but is running into a file not found error. Let's dive into the details. Our viewer has set up their application in the Google App Console and generated an app ID. However, when attempting to access the video list through their Android application, they receive a java.io.filenotfound exception. Interestingly, the same request works perfectly in a web browser. What could be going wrong? Welcome back to another technical video. We're gonna go through the question, the answer, and I hope that you get the solution. Guys, I hope you stay crazy just a little bit like me and work your way through to getting to that end resolution. Let's get started. Let's start by understanding the error you're encountering. The file not found exception indicates that the request to the YouTube API is failing. Specifically, you're receiving a 403 error which means access is forbidden. This error often occurs due to incorrect API key restrictions. Ensure that your API key is configured correctly in the Google Cloud Console. Check that it allows requests from your Android application. Next, confirm that you have enabled the YouTube Data API v3 for your project in the Google Cloud Console. Without this, your requests will not be processed. Finally, ensure that the channel ID and API key used in your request are correct. You can test the URL in a web browser to verify that it returns the expected results. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. If you're facing a file not found error while trying to get your uploaded video list on YouTube, it might be due to your IP address being blocked by Google's authorization server, resulting in a 403 error. To resolve this, visit your API console and adjust the key restrictions. Select the None option under Key Restrictions and try again. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. This user faced a file not found error while working with the YouTube API. They found that the Android API option wasn't effective. To solve the issue, they created a PHP script that retrieves the YouTube playlist twice a day using a cron job. The playlist is saved in JSON format on their server, allowing the Android app to access this cached data instead of hitting the YouTube API directly. This method significantly reduces API quota consumption by directing all requests to their server. If you're interested, they can share the PHP code used to fetch the playlist. Fire! 
let's now look at another user-suggested answer. If you're facing a file not found error on YouTube, try regenerating your API key. Make sure to restrict it with your package name and show one from Android Studio. And that's it guys. We've gone through, answered your question, and hopefully you found that solution you're looking for. Guys, if you did, please hit subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. And until next time, you need technical help, I'll see ya. Have a good one.